what's up again everyone this is Kelly here again and always reminding everyone that it's always a good day and it's always a good life and I am finally here with my third official vlog for my YouTube channel if you happen to be new on this channel I would like to first say thank you for being here with us today and I would like to kindly remind you to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, and if you find interesting topics in my vlog, I would like you to kindly drop a like on my videos. I would like to first apologize for having a hoarse voice, pale skin, dark circles because I've been having a bad cold lately and I'm not fully recovered, so yeah, okay. What we are gonna do for this vlog is something that has been a common question that I've been receiving from my friends or people I know anywhere in social media. They all have asked me, what is my skincare routine if there are any? And how do I maintain my fair skin? I am simply stating how some of those have helped me this is gonna be a rather short video because I'm not feeling 100% by the way I have a disclaimer some of the products that I've used I've only started using I haven't used them in a long time and I only do my skincare at least thrice a week that's all I don't do it every night or every day first off I try to clear my face from makeup. I simply use a clean cloth uh, and I dip it in water. I still have makeup on from today. I don't look good but... <laughs> I remove my makeup every night. That's to prevent pimples. The more you try to prevent having pimples, the less scars you have to deal with. Dirt right there from all the pollution outside. Include your neck gals. I don't usually do this, but now seems to be the great time to tie my hair while doing this, but I don't, I don't usually do that, so forgive me if I didn't do it instantly right before starting this video. Now that we have our face completely bare, the first thing I do is I wash my face, but I can't do it here. I wash my face and apply Koji-san. Skin lightening so it's been effective for me I only let it settle on my face for two minutes because it gets very irritating and we should let our skin be irritated as much as possible for my body I let the soap settle for at least five minutes after I rinse that off I go on and let my face rest for a minute and I use this. Brilliant. It's really good for me, guys. There are three different skincare tools in this rejuvenating facial set. After I've washed my face with Koji Sun, I apply this during nighttime rejuvenating facial toner, exfoliating toner suitable for acne prone skin. I only put at least three dips in a clean cotton. So right now I have it on there. I'll just pat, 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 pat. I've only been using that for more than two months. But I've seen some improvement on my skin. By the way, try to avoid the sun as much as you can while you are undergoing this treatment. When you know that you are going to be exposed 
on the sun the following day do not use this the best time to use stuff like these is when you know you can completely settle in your house or avoid the sun as much as you can try to bring an umbrella always Let's see that now that we're done with that I'm also gonna introduce to you the other two things in here. I'm gonna use one of them. One is sunscreen gel cream. I use this whenever I'm using this in the following day. I know I'm not gonna be able to avoid the sun. This is sunscreen, so it's helpful when you're using this but I do not recommend you go out under the sun as much as you can try to avoid the sun while you are on these and the other one is a rejuvenating facial cream this is exfoliating cream now we are gonna use this because we can use it before bedtime or nighttime I'm not gonna go to bed yet but By the way, before I forget, do not forget to wash your hands first before doing this. I did. So, yeah. Always keep your hands clean, especially now. And every time you touch your face, make sure that your hands are clean. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but this is how I use it. I do it in circles like this. I put a little extra effort on my bags. I've been getting acne. So I'm done with my rejuvenating facial cream. I use this during night before I go to bed. Anyway. There's one more thing in here. There used to be a Kojic acid soap, but I did not like it. So I went back to Koji-san, which is basically still like Kojic acid soap, but you know, two different ways of how it affected my skin. So yeah, that's it. I'm done with my <laughs> skincare routine. I guess one more secret that I can share with you all is Viola, water. always water everything on your body needs water there was a time when I also used to get a lot of acne but all I ever really did was cleanse my face every night before I go to sleep remove my makeup every day because I never used to do that that's what also caused my pimples to break out and water, 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 please drink your water. It's been really helpful for me. It's been really helpful to a lot of people. More tips, by the way, on how you can take care of your skin. When you are using soap like Koji Sun or any Koji Acid soap, that's going to be harsh for the skin. That's part of the process. But to counter that, what I do, I put lotion on every single day. I'm not gonna even show you what lotion I use because I'm just using whatever's there. So I don't have a specific lotion that I can flex. By the way, there's also this one thing that helps my face. Whenever there are days when I be exposed in extreme heat and at night time my skin feels like it burns or it's just stressed out. I use this Jeju Aloe Ice Watson's is where I usually find them It's an aloe soothing gel lotion with cooling How I use this is I, would, I wash my face first, just bare face and I just put it in 
a circular motion all around my face because the cooling effect is really good. It helps my skin relax. So that's basically how I do my skin. This video was so short. Bye.